Alrighty, I got my game gear out, uh, celebrating the fact that the audio is working on it again. And uh, I thought we would celebrate that by playing some Outrun. Um, I own Outrun on the um, on the Genesis and the Master System. I actually really like the Game Gear version. Um, I, I like the Game Gear version more than the Master System version. Um, so, yeah, the audio on this thing's been rock solid. Uh, again, as loud and clear um, as a Game Gear should be. And, uh, and that's awesome. So, yeah, let's play some Outrun. <laughs> Could have went around.
this is tight. <laughs> Had a couple, uh, couple little hits there in that round. And it's over. <laughs> One crash like that, and it's over in this game. I'd be surprised if I make it to the next round. <laughs> the windmills are Holland, I guess. <laughs> the next section. Didn't even get into it. It kind of looks like I did there, but... I've gotten to the end on that route, um, and I don't think that's the easiest route. If this one's the same as the arcade game, um... Like, the easiest route is something like you go left and then right and then left and then right. Um, I used to always think it was, like, all the way to the, like, left was the easiest route, all the way to the right um, was the hardest route, but that's not how it works. Not in the arcade, anyways. Um, let's go for... Let's go for another round. Some different music. Oh, come on. <laughs> we'll go a different route this time.
Oh, I was not. <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna hit him. It didn't look like I was gonna hit him. Maybe that was my fault. Always we made it to the next stage. Yeesh. I like this section. <laughs> I like the. Uh, is it Rodeo? Or, um. Vegas Strip, anyway. I don't think that's Rodeo. That's <laughs> not even. Not even the same state, is it? Vegas strip though. This looks really good. Um, the color on the phone, like I'm recording this with my phone, um, never picks up the color on the screen. So, like in real life, it's a little bit more vibrant than it looks on the screen. It's just the way it's always been. Obviously I did. I was gonna say, I don't think I'm gonna make it to the next section, and here I am.
Ah, fuck. This slowed me all the way down to 33 kilometers an hour. Sometimes you can hit a car, it'll only slow you down to like 150. Compared to like if you hit the brakes and just slow down, like you might get down to the 220-ish range. So it's always faster to hit the brakes than to even just tap a car. Fuck, and then if you hit a tree and you flip, and, well, yeah. That's so much time wasted. <laughs> you do that, you're done. Pretty sure I wasn't gonna make that one. But again, I'm not sure which like which ones are the easy ones compared to the others. I think the only one I've ever made it to the end is the very top route all the way. Anyways, um yeah, Game Gear's rock solid. The audio on it's been great. Um, super happy with it. Again, I really like OutRun on the Game Gear. Um, I like it more than the Master System version. I think the Master System version just has too much flicker. Um, you know, maybe there's more cars on the road at the same time. You know, the whole thing's obviously higher resolution, so maybe the road seems wider, so you need more cars. Uh, maybe. I don't know. It's just, I remember it being, like, a lot of flicker, right? All those cars on the road flickering, and it's kind of distracting. The Game Gear version, I actually quite like that. Um, if I ever see a real copy of it, I will definitely pick it up. Although I never have um, in the wild. I've seen... Um, I've seen Outrunners, I think. Like, and I think that... Well, maybe I was going to say that might have been a PAL-only release. But it's like the only one I've actually ever seen in a store. Um, I've never seen this Outrun version. Uh, you know what? Maybe this was never released in North America. I'm not sure. Let me know uh, if you've ever seen it, if it's rare. Um, uh, if you've never played it, I like it. As far as like 8-bit arcade racers go, um, you know, I grew up with Rad Racer on the NES, so I like these kind of to-the-point, fast-paced, um, you know, checkpoint uh, racing games, and I think it's a great version of OutRun. Yeah, OutRun on the Sega Game Gear. And again... Game Gear is uh, working great, and uh, still running off uh, Anna Loops. Um, so, yeah, with that sound issue, um, you know, being a volt low voltage issue, it's it's you know it's not because of the the, va the batteries. I get oh, I was you know running it off of a nine volt adapter. Um, anyways, yeah, Game Gear is working great. I love the Game Gear. I love the. I've said it before. I love the way it feels in hand. Um, it's, it's to me, it's just super comfortable to play on. Uh, so yeah, I love the Game Gear, and <laughs> glad it's working.